All right, so these are the plugins I use and the settings I use for Logic Pro X versus Luna. All right, so first I'm deleting these and shutting off all the uh, sends because these plugins won't be shared with Luna. All right, so all right, so we had to duplicate the original test. So first, we're going to start with an instrument plugin that I can share between Luna and Logic Pro X. So I use this Lindrum plugin, and then I use the Infinity EQ from Slate Digital, and I put it on that setting. Then I use this multi-presser from Waves, Arver from that filter. And then for effects, I put uh, the Phase Mistress and the Drip plugin from Kyle Beats. So it's running smooth now. I'm about to add five more tracks. Let's see what that does. Okay, cool. So I'm gonna add like five more. Try to get to fifty five. Let's add five more. Taking it pretty well. Oh, there it is. Okay, so let's start slowly again. And that's where it maxes out. All right, so it capped at uh, like 43 tracks is where it'll be safe at. All right, so let's go look at Luna. Um. There is a little bit of fan noise, but barely. All right, so with Luna, I was kind of surprised with it. It actually kept crashing. Uh, it was at 35 tracks, and for a DAW that's supposed to be smart and be able to switch everything over from like your RAM and your storage and stuff so you can do tracks like a uh, console so you don't have to worry about buffer size and stuff like that. It just stopped working. So what I did was a speed test, see how things would open. And Logic opened pretty quickly with everything ready to go. And Luna just kept like kept crashing. And so what I did was just try to open again and delete tracks. And that wasn't working. So I had to record on my phone to show you that Luna doesn't compare to Logic when it comes to optimization, compatibility, stability. It just doesn't hold up. So with that being said, Luna really doesn't have anything special about it besides the Neve summoning and the tape emulation. But you can pretty much put that in any DAW. 
so I opened up the diagnostics to see what's going on with it, and like I thought it was doing, it crapped out. So I had to force quit that. And I just had to just move on with that. Another thing is the fan noise was ridiculous. It was the loudest thing I ever heard. So if you're not using UAD plugins, I don't really recommend Luna. I would just stick with Logic.